so hello everyone uh, today you all know that uh, joint csir ugc net june 2020 nts score is released and now everybody is waiting for what will be the exact rank so today i will discuss the rank what will be your exact rank from your nts score so you know that nts score is given in your uh, score card so from scorecard you have to uh, predict your rank so what will be the exact rank so you can calculate a rank because uh, from that way 63,892 candidates is already appeared in the examination for these are for life science candidate and so if your NTS score is 95 uh, percentile so you can predict that what will be the exact rank so it will come almost 60,697.4 right now from here your rank your rank will be rank will be 63,892 minus 60,600 97.4 so almost it will come 3195 so your rank is 3195 so if you have 95 percentile right another formula you can do another calculation with that you can predict your rank so you can weigh you can do it in that way your rank your rank equal to 100 minus your score your score into 63 638.638.92 right so if your score is 95 so you can put it here 95 into 638.92 it will come almost near about um, 3195 right so your rank you can predict in that way your rank now the <coughs> whether you will qualified or not now you don't know whether you will qualified or or not qualified we'll discuss from your uh, rank you can predict whether you have qualified or not right so how you can do that now first is um, the qualifying percentage the percentage here in during this exam only one percent student one percent to two percent maximum student will qualify right so if from that way you can predict 63,000 63,892 it's one uh, one percent that means you will get this rank right 638 so 638 so if your rank belongs to 638 then you have a chance to right? now according to percentile if you are belongs to general category general category so your percentile is 99 point and uh, and above 99 and above then there you have a chance right you have a chance to qualify for JRF and if your percentiles uh, belongs to below 95 then 99 sorry below 99 percent then there is a uh, less chance for JRF and if you belongs to 98 to 99 99 these are 99 and above 99 and above percentile these are about percentile eh? percentile percentile so for in if i am 198 to 99 percentile then you have a chance of ls right now another is that if you are belongs to reserve category like in uh, obc obc candidate then you have a percentile on in terms of percentile percentile if you have 95 to 
94 percentile then you have a chance right at the jrf or ls there is a chance and if you are belongs to scst scst and then if you have you, you must have almost near about 90 percentile right 90 percentile then you have a chance for jrf 90 percentile so this prediction uh, this prediction is a little bit difficult because your nts score actually uh, given based on all over the candidates over those candidates appears in the exam on the basis of uh, they have given and and uh, if you are belongs to reserve category then you have you uh, have to wait for because uh, you can and, uh, here's a this prediction is a prox prediction right and may vary from one um, from actual prediction right because uh, because your calculation percentage percentile whatever given in the uh, your uh, scorecard this percentile is based on overall uh, total candidates appears in the exam right on that basis uh, this uh, percentile is given now um, for reserve category they have not mentioned uh, what so you can you can uh, uh, approximately you can consider now if you are belongs to general category so if you have a 98 to 99 percentile then you will be ls and if you are have 99 and above then you have a jrf right then you can and then those are belongs to below 98 percentile 98 to 97 percentile they can start preparation for the next session and uh, because uh, there is less chance for qualifying right so only one to two percent uh, candidate will qualify this exam so you can prepare and start for the next uh, preparation now you can see that the total candidates appears in the exam total candidates these are the category wise candidates appears in the exam now first see the centers and uh, spread these are and in case of life science candidates these are uh, category wise gender wise number of candidate registers are appeared in case of before that we can see here okay now see that the general candidate general uh, life science these are general candidates total number these are ews these are ovc candidates and these are total given female candidates so appears in 43,548 in case of male candidate these are appear total is 20,348 right now trans uh, transgender and total candidate 63,892 now in case of here you can see that these are subject wise candidates appears and registered in the exam total in case of uh, life science these are for general candidates these are appeared candidate 26,780 right and in case of uh, all total candidates 63,892 these are total candidate appears right in the exam now what's the actually your NTS score so from that the December in NTS score is the hundred percent to number of candidates appeared in the session with raw score equal or e less than equal to the candidates, right? And the total number of candidates appeared in the session is total by by total number of candidate appears in that session, right? NTS score of the total is not uh, an aggregate or average of the NTS score of the individual part. NTS score is not the same percentage of the marks obtained, right? Now, if you so if you are below, if you are belongs to the category reserve category, then you can start preparation. If you are NTS score below 890, if your score is below 90, then you can start preparation for the next session, right? And if you are belongs to general category, if your uh, rank if your percentile score belongs to 98 to 99 then you can wait 
and those are below 99 percentile or 98 percentile they can start preparation for the next session because there is no chance for uh, any, any there is no chance for qualify qualified right you will uh, qualify this exam right and OVC candidate percentile 95 to 94 percentile is uh, for OVC candidate you can start preparation if you are below 95 percentile right so um, this uh, so you can uh, prepare uh, we have started a new classroom program in uh, so you can join in our program right and also subscribe our channel hope this helpful thank you